There was a woman called Mashitat Fir'aun. Pharaoh, who said, I did not know any God but me. And Mashitat Fir'aun, this hairdresser, she had embraced Islam in secret. And when she was combing the hair of the daughter of Pharaoh, the king, the one who said he is a God, the comb fell to the ground. And then she automatically, subconsciously picked up the comb and said, Bismillah, in the name of Allah. And this Mashtad Fir'aun, this hairdresser, had five children. And one of them was still breastfeeding. And then the daughter of Fir'aun said, Allah, Abi, are you saying Allah, my father? And she said, no, Allah, the God of your father and yourself and me. And she became angry. She went to her father and said to him, Father, this woman worships another God beside you. He said, what? She know another God beside me? Who is there? Call her to me. And they called her to him. And then she came and stood, a woman, a woman, brothers and sisters, in front of this great Pharaoh. And he said to her, who is your God? And she said, Allah is my Lord. He said, who is Allah? He said, Allah Rabbi wa Rabbuk. And then he said, what? Bring the chains. They brought the chains. They began to punish her and whip her. Who is your Lord? And she would say, Allahu Rabbi wa Rabbuk. And so he ordered for them to bring a large container. And then he spilled hot boiling oil into this container. Large container. And then he said, bring me all her children. And they brought them one by one. He said, worship me, I am your God. She said, never. So he brought her first son and he threw him into the oil. In front of her eyes, his meat and his flesh fell off his body and then his bone disintegrated. Then they brought her next son and she was firm, Allahu Akbar, and they burnt him. She could not stop him. And then her third and then her fourth. Then finally her fifth, he was on her arm and she was about to pull back. She was about to pull back in front of the eyes of all the people. When all of a sudden, and this is the hadith of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. He said, when all of a sudden Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala from above seven skies made her child or infant speak while he was in the cradle. And he said, Isbiri ya ummati, Isbiri ya ummi, Isbiri ya ummi, innaki ala al-haq. Be patient, my mother. You are on the truth. Inna Allah qad wa'adaki bi jannah. Allah, Allah has promised you with a great heaven. Keep going, mother. And then, they threw her son into the boiling oil and then she was next. She knew that she was going to die. And then she began to cry and Pharaoh said, why are you crying? Stop. And she said, I want crying because I want to ask you to do something for me. I don't know if you will do it. He said, ask me for whatever you like. He said, once you throw me into the oil, then I want you to gather whatever is remaining of our bodies and I want you to bury us together in the same grave because I want to be resurrected with my children and I want to go to Jannah with my children I don't want them to go out of my arms and she knew what this life was and what the hereafter was and so they threw her in the, into the oil and she ended up in Jannah